You know, as a kid, I remember lots of bushwalking and camping and basically any opportunity to get out into the great Australian bush. But let's face it, as you get older, things change. You need more than a rolled up pair of jeans for a pillow. Well, do I have a short guided holiday option for you in amazing Southeast Queensland? Take a look at this. It's an hour and a half's drive west of Brisbane to Spices Peak Station at the foot of the majestic Great Dividing Range, where we join Spices Retreats on their all new Scenic Rim Trail. So the Scenic Rim Trail is a four day walk throughout the Great Dividing Range, showcasing some of the best natural uh, area we've got in South East Queensland. Every night you're, you're staying in uh, one of the Spices properties. The first day you're walking into Spices Canopy and uh, spending the top night in our permanent tented site. And then the, uh, the second day, again, uh, we do a bit of a, a circuit and a Spices Canopy. And then the third night is Spices Peak Lodge and a finale with a Dega Station dinner. Now I've been wanting to show you inside these amazing tents, so step inside. Now here we have the beautiful his and hers bathrobes. You've got this amazing bed with feather down pillows and the beautiful linen. And every tent has its very own day bed where you can just relax and take it all in. The Scenic Rim Trail includes all meals and beverages, which are served in the main lodge at Spices Canopy with its open fireplace. Meals are shared around the central dining table and the menu is delicious with lots of hearty homestyle favourites. It's the small touches that make this experience so special, like afternoon tea of freshly made scones served with chilled champagne. On the trail and our first trek takes us to the top of Mount Mitchell through lush eucalypt and rainforest. Our guide Reese shares his amazing knowledge of the bush tucker options on offer. While the Scenic Rim Trail overall is suitable for guests of a good level of fitness, day two is a more leisurely amble. We head across the paddocks of Spices Peak Station and along a nearby river gorge. This is a chance to unwind and enjoy the magnificent bush setting. It's a really beautiful spot and there's plenty of time along the way to stop and smell the flowers. And we happen to catch the tail end of this slippery character taking a bath. Day three, and we head off early for the climb to the top of Spices Peak in the Main Range National Park and on to Spices Peak Lodge for our final night. And Australia's highest non-alpine lodge. And apparently they have a great spa. And I think I'm gonna need a little piece of TLC when I eventually get there. Boy. The views from the top of the peak back towards Spice's Canopy are sensational and well worth the climb, as is the chance to walk through this extraordinary Gondwana rainforest. It's a warm welcome on arrival at Spice's Peak Lodge, a member of the Luxury Lodges of Australia, and a fabulous way to end this experience. The included five course tasting menu is superb. And as the sun sets over the spectacular scenic rim on this Aussie touring adventure, check the website for more details.